just saying, man. Like what? Like Fox News and those outlets, especially OAN and Newsmax, are considered like fringe. You know, Fox is considered like a right wing news outlet, and all the other channels, all the institutions, the the schools, the universities, all teach their students, all pump out to their viewers that Fox News is right wing media, and we all know right wing is constantly used as a pejorative, so right wing is bad. And anything you hear from these people, you can just ignore, you can just discount it, which is why the suppression of the Biden laptop story works so well because half the country was totally willing to just look the other way and not just that but like the Biden uh diary the uh his daughter's diary do you know about that i no i don't know about his daughter's See, diary that's crazy that's just crazy you don't know about that so there was this diary and if you want if you want to wait if you want to do this i can name a million different things that republicans have done no i'm just saying like the president okay. showered with his daughter and she wrote about it in a diary and like that's not, how's that not huge news? Like, why the why should I know about why why why, why should would I give that a not fuck? be huge news? That's the why do, why should I care about his kids? Child with his daughter. You don't think that's weird? His daughter was didn't like on it. Jeffrey his daughter Epstein's didn't plane. like it. Who was riding on Jeffrey Epstein's plane? Uh, is this like a Trump did it thing? I don't care. I, um, oh, I mean he did. I don't. Look, I, I'm sorry. I'm still baffled by this. Why should I care if Don, if, if Joe Biden showered with his daughter? How old was his daughter? Why should I even care? Dear Lord Jesus, this ain't happening, man. This can't be happening, man. This ain't happening. That's fucking. It's because it's he's a why pedo. Should I that he's a weird. pedo. How does that make him a pedophile? That he's that he that he showered with his daughter. Excuse me. What? What have you bathed your children ever? Do you have kids? Yeah, but this is an older child. She's like twelve or thirteen or something. I don't care. Why? <laughs> who gives a fuck? Well, my point is, my point is not even to get into that, but just the fact that you know, that's you know, not... you know that one, you know that one football star that like kisses his kids on the lips. I think it's Tom Brady. Tom Brady kisses a kid, his thirteen, fourteen year old son, on the lips. Does that make him a pedophile? Is Tom Brady no. a pedophile now? No. I, can't, I don't think I kiss my kids on the lips. I don't kiss my kids on the lips. But does that but, make does that make Tom Brady a pedophile every time no, we talk about Tom Brady playing with football? Your, your we bring up, kids? That he kisses yeah. his child is that he kisses a little boy on the lips. Okay. Anyway, you remember anyway, when, my I point just, my just, point in bringing that up uh, was that it's not a major. It's the media's never it shouldn't talked be about a major that. news story. That's a stupid fucking story. It shouldn't get any attention. <laughs> and you're telling me if Trump or like Jim Jordan, if a diary of their daughter whoa, whoa, came out saying. You want to talk about weird relationships with your daughter? Trump has said some pretty weird things. Like I would be. I agree. I agree. There is some weird shit between weird Trump stuff, and his daughter. But I don't care. Who? But cares? that was big news. Everybody knows about that. Do you think anybody should care about that? No, but everybody knows about that, right? Well, no, 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 no. You, I just no, no, no. no. Yes, yes, yes. Have, yes. Right. I want to see you're consistent. I want to see you're consistent. You got to be consistent. That you say, well, everybody wait, knows wait, about wait, that Trump position, story with his my daughter. My position is I don't care about his daughter's story, and I don't care about the Biden story. But, but your point is, is Joe Biden's a pedophile because he showered with his daughter. But Joe Biden is, is Donald Trump. Wait, wait. So Joe Biden's a pedophile because he showered with his daughter. But Donald Trump. Like we shouldn't know about him, like having that weird relationship with his daughter. I right, just don't but think everybody any of it's does. Important. I didn't say we shouldn't know. I said everybody does know. Nobody knows. Only people on the right know about the shower thing because we're getting, we're reading stuff that is being hidden from the other half of the country. That's my it's point. Hidden? Absolutely. If the media doesn't report it, for most people, it never happened. Most people are not so, like okay. us. Most people. Okay, sorry. Can it? Can we? Let's do this. CNN breaking news. CNN breaking news. Startling reports yes. that Joe Biden showered with his yes. daughter. Let's talk yes. about that. Chris Chris Hayes, can you talk about this? This is obviously the darkest day in our democracy to hear that Joe Biden Dude. has showered with his daughter. It's like, Dylan. What would, how would they even cover the story? Dylan. It's not important. Look at these, not look at all news. these fake stories that the media covered that weren't even real, like, especially concerning it's, Trump. Like, look, the at, you look at those thing. fake stories. Every single one of those fake stories are probably more newsworthy than the idea that Joe Biden <laughs> showered with the his Koi daughter. Pond? I don't care. The, the care koi the... pond with the Japanese prime minister. That shit was funny though. Oh, the, how about okay? How about how about the uh, the um, uh, uh, fuck the um, bounties on soldiers story? That was um, fake. That turned out to be totally totally fake. I think it. I think it's most likely fake. I don't. I didn't follow it too closely. Yeah, but they but used I didn't that. See, for... I didn't ever. Have you ever heard the term "dry by media"? Uh, no, I haven't used okay. the term drive-by media. It's something media, Rush but, Limbaugh coined. But, uh, okay, so 
Wait, wait, wait. Let me ask you a question. Would it be more newsworthy for Russian soldiers to be, for the Russian government to be placing bounties on the heads of American soldiers or Joe Biden showered with his, like, 12-year-old daughter? It seem both seem like, well, first of all, one has Please, evidence, the other one has on. no evidence. Can you answer my question? Yes. What would one be has more evidence and is newsworthy. newsworthy. You're not, the okay, other you're not, has no you're not evidence and is question. not newsworthy. You're not, you're not answering my question. I am. If, no, you're not, because my question was if there is a news story about Russian sol about the Russian government placing bounties on American soldiers' head, I'm not telling you whether it's if it's real or not real. That versus Joe Biden shower showering with his 12 year old daughter. What is more newsworthy and deserving of so attention? So what what is a journalist's job uh, when they're I'm asking you a straight a story. question and I right, want okay, you to answer I'm going to answer straight. you. Uh, a journalist job when they're reporting a story I, i'm pretty sure you gotta have more than one source and for that story they had zero sources so they went ahead and reported that anyway just like many others but when it comes to the joe biden diary story which has evidence hard evidence they report nothing it's literally blank and when it comes to hunter biden and his laptop and the connections that it might show between business dealings between him and his father that are shady the media just before an election big tech and the government worked to suppress it called it russian disinformation called it called anybody who was spreading it uh spreaders of russian disinformation and conspiracy kooks uh and then it turned out to be real didn't so, answer my question at all i did oh you did it my qu fuck i'll ask you for the third time and if you don't yeah. answer it we're just gonna have to move on all okay right. All right. if there are two stories and one of them is the russian government is plating bounties on the head of american soldiers killing american soldiers people are dying I did answer versus you. versus joe biden showering with his 12 year old daughter what is a, a new story more worthy of coverage the one with evidence to back it up. You didn't answer my question. We just got to move did. on. You can't answer it. No, because the Biden my story. Question, I'm answering you, it. The I'm Biden talking. story is a more worthy okay. story. God, you were. I can't engage with you. Okay, so my question is about the veracity of the narrative of this story. That if you are a journalist and you're handed these two pieces of paper, you see the thing about American soldiers dying due to the Russian government, you're gonna cover that, whether or this not. Is just, that's this is just. It's different now, when I do it. This that's is all it different is. now. You're not answering my question. No, you're not I, answering I my hear question. you. I've heard because, you ask okay, it. This like, is separate from the amount of evidence to back up these two stories. I'm just presenting you story A and story B, right? right? And right. I need you to answer this question or we cannot you talk. You want me to say the, that the Russian bounty story is more... I know you want me to say that that's the is, more important story. It obviously is. And so if from it your was... Point of view, <laughs> From your point of view, that's so you're an opinion. Thinking, there's a scenario. Right, that's an opinion. Your, there's a scenario where American soldiers dying is less important than Joe Biden showering but, with his 12 year old but, daughter. But the story wasn't that soldiers were dying. It was that there was a bounty on them. What do you think that leads to? Well, right. But the, first of all, there's no soldiers dying connected to any bounties for one, right? But if they're placing bounties on American soldiers, that's endangering but, the but, lives of American okay, soldiers how many, <laughs> and getting right. them killed. Okay, so you're saying it endangers their lives. See, this is, it reminds me of what we hear from the media when, when it comes to criticism, it endangers our lives. Uh, is there any examples of like that actually endangering your life? No, but we're gonna use is there, that as is there Is there examples of bounties being placed upon the heads of Americans endangering them? Yes. In Iraq, is. maybe, yeah. Yes, yeah, so there's a there's a stand. There's, this is something that's happened before, okay, and so if it well, happens again, that would be of concern, wouldn't okay, it? Okay, well, let me, so the the problem with that is that, and you're saying that the other one was more important story, so they should have gone with that. But the problem is they had no evidence. Not, wait, or hold wait, on, no, they no, had no. no I hold on. That's not what I said. You never answered my question. I didn't say anything. You just didn't answer my question. No, so I, I did though. To make a point. <laughs> I did though. No, I just, didn't, point, I just didn't answer it the question. way you wanted Every me to. Time you avoided it. No, your I question. I did avoid no, it. The way you're supposed to answer it is say this one or this one, and right. and I'm separating Biden it from the evidence important. backing it. Okay, got you. So you believe that dead Americans is less important what than being Americans? able to kill Joe Biden a pedophile. What Americans, Americans getting killed by Taliban fighters on the back of Russian bounties placed upon American heads. That would which, be less important than Joe which, Biden showering with his 12-year-old daughter. Which dead soldiers have been linked to bounties? This is, I'm, you're, oh my fucking God. I'm talking about if we put these two stories next to each other, what would be more important if we isolate the story, not the evidence, not what actually happened? What am I talking about? Isolating the story. And uh, because I'm talking to you about what would be more important to cover in a newsroom. Because then I can move on to the second point, my actual point of what I'm trying to get to, if you answer this question honestly. A or B, that's the two options. Right, I already said A, because okay. B's got so, no evidence to back it up. And B, okay. they like that story better because they could damage Trump with it, which is the only reason they went with oh. it.
Which is okay, why they so went I'm, with tons of... Hold on, Dylan. 